Guys, for all the solutions of this book, visit forthesakeofeducation.com. I've been working hard of putting all the problems into one convenient place for you to be able to do your homework easily. So pay us a visit. All right, guys, let's do this problem that says determine the centroid uh, y of the shaded area. So notice that it's only asking for the y, it's not asking for the x, but it's going to become painfully obvious uh, y in a second. Because when you're doing these problems, remember that the formula is x bar is equal to the integral of the area of x curly dA curly dA. I mean, sorry, the integral of the area. So these problems always start with the same thing. What is dA? Now in this case, dA is this right here. And you know that the centroid of this rectangle of a rectangle is right there, right? So this already gives you a bunch of information. This, which is dy, and the thickness, which is 2x, because you know from here to here, we have x, so that is 2x. So you know that dA is equal to 2x dy. Now, this rectangle also tells you that x curly is at 0, and it's always going to be at 0. That's why they're not asking for it, because it's 0. And then you know that y curly, which is this, is y. So this is all the information you need plus the equation to be able to solve this function. That should be cake from here. Now, x bar is zero, so I mean x curly is zero, so this is zero when you replace it at the top. And that's it. If you had to find the centroid, but they're only asking for y. Now let's put the formula dA over the integral of the area, dA. So dA is, this is the integral from 0 to 2, because dy is on the y, of y, and now we replace by 2x dy, because you know that y curly is y, and we know that dA is equal to 2x dy, over the integral of from 0 to 2 of 2x dy. We go here. Now we're basically going to replace dx. So we know that y is equal to 2x squared. So let's solve for x and we get that y over 2 square rooted. And you're just going to plug that in to the equation and replace it for x. And you're going to get that the integral from 0 to 2 of y times 2 times the square root of y over 2 dy all over the integral from 0 to 2 of 2 square root of y over square root of 2 dy now we're going to just start simplifying this equation uh, the top is going to look like this square root of 2 y 3 over 2 dy integral from 0 to 2 and the bottom is going to look like square root of 2 y to the 1 half from 0 to 2 dy now if we keep going we're going to get that this is equal to 2 over 5 square root of 2 times the square root of 2 times y to the 5 over 2 from 0 to 2 over 2 over 3 square root of 2 times y to the 3 halves from 0 to 2. This is just basic calculus. When you plug in the numbers, which is 2 and 0, the second one 0 cancels everything out, so you just got to basically plug in the 2. And you get 3.2 over 2.67. Just plug in the 2 on the calculator. And all of this on the calculator. And you'll get it. 
and you're going to get that the centroid is equal to y bar times 1.2 and the centroid like I said is at 0 comma 1.2 which is somewhere over there final answer final answer